what's up guys welcome back to the channel today i'm i'm extremely excited because i have some lithium as you can see in the background and today this video is pretty much talk about the fact that going lithium is 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 not optional it's actually mandatory that you go lithium or or unless there's something better than lithium coming out soon but for now you have to move from lead acid to lithium there's no doubt about it there's no two ways to that and i'm saying that from my perspective being in jamaica pretty much in the background as you can see we have lead acid and we have lithium and this is why i'm really excited because over the past couple of months we've been faced with a situation where we can't get lead acid batteries anymore so here you are seeing six dead rows solid rows 235 amp hour batteries they are all dead batteries and when I went out to try and get replacement for these batteries, I was told by the suppliers, all the suppliers, that hey, we don't sell those batteries anymore. We don't stock them. We don't ship them. So you probably need to think about an alternative solution. So it got so bad to the point where I was down to six batteries. Those six 235 amp hour batteries and luckily i was told by one supplier that they have a few of the 445 amp hour rules those the two big ones so i got those and i managed to have pretty much now five kilowatt and that is what we've been using for the past couple of months so i decided that well i need to i need to get some batteries so this is my first attempt at getting some lead some lithium batteries these are 304 amp hour batteries and as you know we are running a 24 volt system so we have eight of these batteries but what i want to talk about today other than just the fact that we have to move to lithium I want to talk about the fact that the, the the improvement in the batteries. So I place them here so guys you can see the comparison. These are 304 amp hour batteries. So it means that approximately we have 7.6 kilowatt of batteries here. And if you look over there, the lead acid equal to 5 kilowatt of batteries and we can talk about so many things um advantages and disadvantages we know about the c rate um the 304 amp hour lithium batteries have a c rate of 1c discharge and 0.5c charge rate so you can charge at 100 and 52 amp hour continuous and discharge at 304 amp hour continuous you can't do that with the lead acid the other thing is the obvious is the space then you think about maintenance then you think about the fact that the lithium batteries have a bms so i'm, I'm awaiting a jk bms a 200 amp hour bms 200 amp bms with two amp active balancing so guys that's that's pretty much what this video is about just to tell you that yeah we are moving to lithium and um you can see these images of where we are coming from with lead acid as you all know we've been in been living off grid for more than 15 years and we've gone through a number of different lead acid batteries from regular 12 volt batteries to trojan we have got several different types and ample of lead acid we have gone through now we are moving to lithium so stay tuned we are gonna be um building up the frame in the next couple of days um we're gonna be doing the compression the 
the separation we're gonna be doing our own separation disc we're gonna be using some not the fancy plastic we're gonna be using our own plastic for the separation um we're gonna be doing some welding to to get the compression bar we're gonna be using the three studs or three rails if you want to call them that as the rec manufacturers recommend for their testing that's what we're gonna be doing for the 304 amp hour um, lithium cells and it's gonna be fun stuff we're gonna be using the victron to charge them we're gonna um, calibrate the victron we're gonna be doing all of that good stuff and then we're gonna move those let us it out and we're gonna build a separate system with the two large let us battery to power the perimeter lighting um and pretty much that's it we're gonna be getting another set by the way of lithium cells to give us a total of 50 kilowatt hours and i believe that will be fine but stay tuned and remember to like share um comment you want to talk and subscribe see you in the next one